हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज अभिषेक बगेरवाल वेलकम टू सेल्स वर्स ऑमनी स्टूडियो सीरीज इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोन शो यू हाउ टू कॉन्फिगर अ डेटा रैप्टर इन ऑमनी स्टूडियो सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो आई हैव ओपन द ऑमनी स्टूडियो एप्लीकेशन एंड इन दैट आई हैव ओपन ऑमनी स्टूडियो डेटा रैप्टर लिस्ट व्यू सो आई एम गोन क्लिक न्यू आई एम प्रोवाइडिंग इट नेम एज टेस्ट फैच account details interface type i am giving it as turbo extract because i want to get the data from single salesforce object that is account object input type i am keeping it as json and output also i am keeping it as json click save so it has saved the, our data raptor and uh, now it has opened the data raptor console where you can define the object and filter option and which fields you want to extract and you can test it you can actually test it as well in the preview section so under the extract tab i'm going to define which object i want to query that is account and here you can give any name as the output will be the account an account record will be the output of this data raptor so i'm giving the name as account itself and filter i'm giving it as id equals account id again this is a variable name this is also you can give anything as output path fields which i am getting that would be account number account name phone then type then industry and then website so some of these information i want this data raptor to fetch for me based on the account id that i provide okay so now let's see what is there in options so options uh, you can define time to live in minutes like for how long uh, this data raptor should be going on you want if you want to provide field level security check as well that also you can provide and this is some uh, cache uh, you want to configure over here and then in the preview section you can actually see it in action so i am providing account id here column in the double quotes any account id i'm going to provide then click execute so as you can see it has returned the account which i was trying to get so it has provided me account number name website all the fields which i have configured in the extract path okay so and you can see it has created this account information under a node which is the account which i have provided as extract output path okay so that's how you can configure a data raptor in omni studio similarly you can configure extract and load and uh, transform data raptor as well so that was all about this video if you like it please like it and comment on it for more please subscribe my channel as abhishek bagherwal thank you